I'm going to do a quick rig demonstration of a new character that I've created and on my YouTube videos um, on my channel you'll be able to see how I've already created the head the hands and the feet so this is just predominantly about the body but I'm going to just delve in and take a look at all the components of this rig so if we look at the head first go to our head layer he's got his eye motion so he can look left and right they can open wide and he has veins in his eyes when they open to the extreme they can close so his pupils can go down and up and his eyebrows work and they also give wrinkles within his forehead when they go up to the extreme and same when they go down we have smart bones for individual eye actions also so we've got the left eye can close the top lid and the same for the bottom lid and we've got one for the left brow and we've got a action for the opposite opposite side also and we've got one here for the nose which brings the nose down and up within its face if we move over to this side we've got smart bones that control the mouth so we've got the smile and the frown we've got this opens the lips only and this opens the mouth with the teeth this one makes the lips shrink inwards and it spreads it wide and this is for the F and M or well, the M and V sounds and then we have the lips that are able to go left and right and if I play all of these together I'll just delete these keyframes so we've got one for the teeth so if I open up his lips and done his teeth I can independently move his teeth or use this bone to do it completely I've also got a bone here which is basically quick phonemes so we've got different talking actions that are represented by using this this dial here and the L and R so this kind of moves the lips and it kind of gives you a nice effect you get different types of looks we've got one for the down and up motion also if we move up to his head so these bones at the top of the head we've got one that makes the head go up and down and again these all work And then we've got a head turn that looks both directions and the head goes all the way to the back so that's the head side of it I'm going to quickly move on to the body now if we look here we have a few smart bone actions a few smart bone dials and for the start on this side we've got one that makes the arm go for the score to the first frame this pulls the arm closer to the camera and the other side pulls it behind the character's back the same for the opposite side and we've also got the action for the leg so it will pull his foot up and behind his back and again it works on the other side and we've also got one for the body so this does the same for the body so it would bring it forward and it will make the character lean back so it kind of gives it that dynamic 3D effect 
and then we've got our body turn bone and the character works in all angles no matter which way I face our character everything still works um, the legs are bending a bit funny because of the way the target bones were bent initially so I'll just bend them correctly and as you can see our character turns and bends in both directions and you can go fully to the back also and as I said again everything works as you'd expect it and then we've got these bones here on the side and I've just been playing about with this rig and trying to find out the limitations and different creative ideas so I've got these bones here that morph our character into different actions so uh, if I use the Hulk it makes our character Hulk out we've got one for he turns into Superman and again it all works everything works just as you'd expect it to we've also got one for Iron Man and various different others so we've got a Spider-Man a Batman and we've got a Flash also and as I said as before everything works got a quick walk cycle that I'll just add to our character find it and I could have him more from say nothing into Superman Or from Superman into Iron Man so I can remove this and let's say I want Iron Man to start earlier so now we've got and I can have him morph into the Hulk say Then I can have him shrink from the Hulk into the Flash. So maybe I could. Something like that. So yeah, just had a quick demonstration. And as I said, everything works. Well, not on the flash, but on most of them. Just as you expect it. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed it, guys.